hello guys welcome to my channel today we are going to see how to fix the issue with your ssd or hdd or your pen drive you are getting the error disk one unknown not installed let's fix it guys first of all i need to tell you one thing guys very clear that no process in the world exits to fix out your issue without formatting the hard disk but you don't need to worry i have a solution if you have pen drive then take a backup of the particular drive after taking backup of the particular drive you just need to go to search menu and type cmd right click on the command prompt and select run as administrator and select yes now you just need to check my video description for this command used in my video in this first command in G letter you need to change the letter of the drive which is showing disk one unknown not installed you just need to type the letter of the disk guys in my case D disk you just need to change the disk over here Ch letter you just need to type the disk letter and after that just copy this command copy with the control C and paste with the control V and press enter wait for this process to finish this will help you to repair and fix the error in drive D after finishing this process now you just need to check if the problem solved or not if not let's move on to the second solution guys I simply suggest you to change the USB port sometimes CIA 2.0 USB doesn't work with the USB 3.0 so just try changing the port and check if the problem solved or not if not let's move on to the third solution guys you just need to go to search menu and type cmd right click on the command prompt and select run as administrator and select yes now you just need to check my video description for this command used in my video you just need to copy it disk part you just need to copy it and paste with the control v and press enter and now copy the letter disk and paste here and as you can see the disk name is listed over here you need to select the drive which is giving you the error disk one unknown not installed in my case disk one you need to verify the size of the disk in my case 111 gp the disk one disk is the problematic disk after checking it you just need to check my video description for this command you just need to type the number of the problematic drive in my case the problematic drive is one only the gp of the drive i checked it and after checking it you just need to copy it and paste it press enter disk one is now selected now you just need to copy the next command and paste it after pasting the clean if you hit the enter key your disk will be formatted guys i already said you take your backup of the problematic drive after finishing cleaning the disk you just need to copy the next command and paste it convert gpt once the partition is converted to gpt don't close the cmd guys you just need to go ahead and check if the problem solved or not if not let's move on to the fourth solution guys you just need to copy the next command one by one and paste it for the fourth solution copy it and paste in here copy with the control c and paste with the control v the last command is assign and the last final command is exit press enter and after finishing this close it off here go ahead and restart your pc after restarting your pc check if the problem solved or not if not let's move on to the final solution guys you just need to check my video description for this link used in my video you just need to scroll down and select this download freeware and download this program after getting download this you just need to install the program select as select ok select continue installing free edition and select next just need to check mark mini tool partition wizard free and select next now select finish and the program will be launched automatically 
here all the disk will be shown guys you just need to right click on the disk the problematic disk with the letter of D and the GP of the size you just need to check it you just need to right click on the problematic disk and select here option you can able to see the option up over here installize to MBR disk you just need to select it guys installize to MBR disk after selecting it select apply and select yes and after doing this now you just need to again right click on the disk 2 and select rebuild MBR and select apply and select yes and after doing this select ok in disk 2 near you can able to see unallocated space you just need to right click on it and you can able to see the option create you just need to select the create option guys and it will automatically create a partition and drive letter you just need to simply click on ok and now your disk is ready to use guys i hope one of the solution fixed your problem if the video helped you don't forget to leave a like guys you can also subscribe me and support me guys thank you